I was 18 when I had my first seizure. I was standing in the supermarket with my mother and without warning, suddenly, bang. Epilepsy affects one in 26 people. Epilepsy is where the messages get mixed up um, in your brain where the pathways don't connect properly and they make a misfire and anyone with a brain can have a seizure at any point in their life, any race, any age, doesn't discriminate. It is something that comes as a shock, especially if you've got your life planned out and you know where you're going. I wasn't able to have a licence anymore, I wasn't able to go to the States to be an au pair, no one wanted someone who had epilepsy. I lost my job and then I had to readjust. The Epilepsy Foundation has had a huge impact on my life. They've been able to support me through really difficult times. It's important for me to be a volunteer and donate my time to the Foundation because when I was first diagnosed and my family and I were going through so much, we received so much from the Foundation and I felt like I could give back to the Foundation that had helped me so much and be able to help other people who are going through the same thing. In March, I was nominated as a shining light for the Western Pacific region for my community service towards epilepsy, which was unbelievable. I didn't think at first that it was real. I thought it maybe it was a mistake or something. I hope together we can achieve less stigma on epilepsy. People to be not happy with their diagnosis, but accept their diagnosis. You hear about other conditions that are just as important as epilepsy. I'm not saying that they aren't, but epilepsy is kind of dismissed. It's People still look at it negatively. People still think of it as some demon thing and it's time it was respected. So I hope to help the Foundation continue to make a positive impact.